Hi guys, this is Joe from Techy Lobang. Today I have something special for you. It is the creative latest product, the Super X5M. It's a very small device, it's actually an amplifier for your headphones that you can connect to your mobile device or to your computer. So um, in Singapore, we are so-called the early adopters whereby we book online and we are able to book a session, a demo session with uh, Creative Labs and we went to their office for a tryout on this device and also to experience the, the power of this small little device. So let's take a look at this. It's very small. You are connected to your device using a USB-C port and then over here is to your normal headphone jack so I did not do the unboxing because uh, let me show you the box if I show you the box you know why I don't need any unboxing because it's really a very simple box nothing to show a very small device nothing to show so for Singapore right um, because we are the early adopters, so uh, Creative Labs have thrown in a freebies for us and it's this Alvana Special Edition headphones so on the website it says it's $99 Singapore dollars and um, I think it's a good deal because this device itself costs $219 Singapore dollar and because I have a discount code, maybe I'll show you somewhere, a discount code, I am able to get it at 199 Singapore dollar. Plus, I get a free headphones worth $99. I think this is a really, really good deal. Today, I want to show you something. Because um, if you look at the website, it says that this device is actually for Android or for your PC computer or Macintosh computer but it doesn't say anything about uh, using it on your iPhone however when I was at the demo I was we were given this impression that actually it can be done so let me show you how with some simple hacks you can actually make it to work on your iPhones so first you need to have this You need to have this. This is the standard accessories from iPhone. It is the Lightning USB camera connection. Okay, you need to have this first. So this is the exercise. This is the exercise. And because it's using a USB A port, so you need a converter cable over here a converter cable to convert it to a USB-C port okay this is a USB-C port and once you're connected you have a lightning port and a USB-C port and right now with this device you can connect to the USB-C port and then this side you can connect to your iPhone there you have it a iPhone compatible Super X5M however um, just a note of caution this hack is actually not recommended by or not supported by Creative Labs. If you want to use the Super M feature, Super X, Super X Y M features, there's another product that is coming soon. There's a Super X Five Air, Super X Five Air. That is coming soon. I think is in November or somewhere around there 
So that device is actually a Bluetooth headphones with um, connection that can be connected to the iPhones. I'm not an audiophile, however, based on what I've heard, I am really, really thinking that any other headphones that I've had is not enough now because of the sound, the space. They call it the, the spatial sound or the 3D holographic audio that we have, um, that we can hear from this device. It's going to change the way we listen to music. So a lot of people are saying that 3D, 3D sound is not, is not new. It's like uh, maybe 20 years old technology. However, I guess um, for Creative Labs, they spent about $100 million. Um, this is actually from Mr. Sim. Uh, I got to meet him today at the event because uh, I, I think he's uh, there to support the staff which I feel is very good. So he talked to me about this, um, the R&D that he has spent to get this right. So to say that 3D music or 3D, 3D sound from this device is a little bit too simple. It actually involves a lot of um, R&D. And um, if you know that this, uh, if you know about this device, you also should know about the app that it has with it. This is the app. I don't know whether you can see or not. This is the app. So you can actually personalize the app. You can actually personalize the app by scanning your ear, your face, and then after that, connect to your headphones, and finally. You get good sound coming out from the device itself. So I'm going to stop here because uh, the ultimate thing is I can't show you music. You have to listen to it to know the differences. So one of the more important takeaway from this demo is that uh, if you are really into music or you love all all these. Go and find if you have a device. Go and check out uh, any old songs, like for example, maybe those songs that was uh, recorded in mono. Plug this device in and listen to it with the amplifier on. I'm sure you'll be amazed by the results because I am really, really amazed by the result after listening to one track uh, during the demo. Based on my initial test on this device during the demo, I find that this is really worth the 199 Singapore dollar that I spent. So that's it. I think I talked too much. That's it.